Well, we're, we're down here in, uh, I guess, uh, south central Saskatchewan. Uh, and it's definitely uh, in one of the drier parts of Saskatchewan, the, the, the mixed grassland or the uh, brown soil zone. Uh, this, is, this is a dry area. Uh, I think precipitation here is about 400 millimeters per year, which isn't too much different than, say, Saskatoon. But because of the, uh, this is a, a, an open and, and windy area with a lot of sunshine, the effectiveness of that precipitation is less, and so this is, this is a semi-arid area, and, uh, and it's reflected in the vegetation and in the soils. So can you tell me a bit about the, about the vegetation that we see here? Well, the, the vegetation here is, is really typical of the, of the mixed grassland. Uh, some of the, of the taller grass that, with the, uh, that you see is, is, is stipa, and there's, I'm sure there's some, also some agropyrin species in here. Uh, a couple of other species that really uh, you, you one notices right away is the, uh, the grayish colored pasture sage or Artemisia frigida mm -hmm. and gumweed. Gumweed is the yellowish flowers and gumweed often grows on sort of challenge soils you might say such as solanetsic soils. It's, it's really a typical species in, in areas like this. So in terms of the parent material, what sort of parent material are we expecting to have here? Well, uh, this is an area of glacial till. It's uh, sort of a roughly undulating, almost hummocky kind of landscape that we expect uh, with glacial till. It's, there's not a lot of relief here, but there are some, some small knolls and, there, and there's some depressions in between. And uh, the parent material is, is a glacial till deposited directly from by the, by the glaciers about, let's say, about 20,000 years ago or 15,000 years ago. And here, quite interestingly, uh, it appears that we may actually have two glacial till units. An older, darker unit that may be um, perhaps 100 or 200,000 years old, and an upper unit, which is definitely the, the deposit from the last glacier, uh, let's say about, uh, about 15,000 years ago.